this right here is the temple mound, the Islamic temple, where they keep that precious black stone. This is the heart and soul of the Muslim religion of Islam. You know, the religion that causes people to fly in the airplanes in the buildings. The religion that is full of hate. Wouldn't this world be a much, much happier world if we could destroy Islam? If we could kill the religion of Islam? So, if I was king, or if I was president, I'd find an excuse to if, the, if, if those Islamic ragheads started acting up to the United States, I would send a Tomahawk cruise missile, or two, or three, or four. Now I would utterly annihilate this temple. I would, no, no, for, no, first I would, I would send a, an elite Delta Squad, Delta Squad, a mer a military elites. The seize the black stone. And then after they left, I'd send about ten or twenty Tomahawk cruise missiles to totally level and flatten that temple mound, temple, utterly destroy it. And then I would take the black stone and show it on the internet for those Islamic ragheads to see. I crush that stone up, and then I would fly over the, the ocean. I wouldn't tell them which ocean. And I would scatter the powder all over the ocean. Destroy the, yeah, the Temple Mound in Mecca. One of the pillars of Islam is to visit Mecca. You pray bowing towards Mecca. If we could destroy the Temple Mound and prove that Allah is not God, there is no God whose name is Allah, and Muhammad is not his prophet. Muhammad is the prophet of the devil. If we could destroy this temple mound, Islam would begin to wither. Now, to be, to be sure, the extremists would find something else to latch on to, but their devotion would be a lot weaker because the temple mound has been, been there for hundreds of years. So the, the bond to Islam is much stronger as so long as this temple mound starts. When you destroy this temple mound, you have extremists latching on to certain elements. Uh, the, maybe the site that the temple stood on. But the devotion is going to be weak because we show them that Allah is not God. And then once that happens, the Israelites can build, you know the Jewish temple in the future is supposed to, is going to stand on the same site that the temple mound stands on? And then we can get closer and closer to the second coming of Jesus Christ. For I say, if we could kill the religion of Islam, we'd be a much, this world would be much, a much happier place. And that religion of hate was killed! Amen and amen.